follow Rachel on Twitter and Instagram to get an inside look at what really goes on behind the scenes. Oh, you know, I just remembered I'm missing chives for my mom's dip. Hey guys, can you bring out some chives? Um, my mom makes a delicious uh, horseradish spread and we put it out at the holidays with sliced roast beef or uh, whole beef tenderloin uh, off the grill in the summertime. Um, but it's also delicious for oven fries. So my mom's horseradish sauce is a whole bunch of horseradish freshly grated or prepared. Thank you, sweetheart. Um, chives provided by Grant. <laughs> and then my mom's... My mom's uh, kind of secret ingredients are to balance out the heat of all the horseradish, she adds a little bit of unsweetened applesauce to her sauce. And for stability, if you're gonna use it to dip things, like we're gonna use it to dip some oven fries, she adds a little bit of plain breadcrumb, just fine breadcrumb. And it keeps the sauce together if it's gonna sit. And of course you should chill it down until you're ready to serve. But this is awesome with oven fries, delicious with roast beef of any kind, just a good old roast beef sandwich slathered with this, with a little bit of the uh, Upland Crest spicy greens, you know, the next day for a sandwich. How good would that be? Yum. And then chop up a whole bunch of chives. Throw that into your sauce. Salt and pepper. And you're done. Now for thick cut, for thick cut oven fries, I like to do a 10 cut on large russet potatoes. So the bigger the potato, the better. Cut it in half and then get five wedges out of each side. Uh, 10 cut, I call it. And then you're gonna throw them into a real hot oven at a very high temp, 425 until they're deeply golden and crispy. Oh God, they smell amazing. So these are like thick cut oven steak fries. I know! And look at over here! Look at over here, oh my God. Look, our patty melt's coming off with that blue cheese and the Worcestershire burgers with the steak sauce. Ridiculous! Ridiculous! I'm sorry.